When they got to the main square, it was abandoned, except for one man who appeared to be guarding what looked like the town hall. Cunup approached him and asked him in fluent Czech what he was guarding, and the man said that inside was a meeting of the local resistance. He took me in, led me down a long corridor into a large room where gathered on the far end were about a dozen men around the table. As I approached them, they were silent, perhaps not knowing what was happening. I greeted them in their language, Chindobre, told them that I was a lieutenant colonel of the United States Army, that I was of Czech heritage, and that my division was coming to liberate their country. Well, that room exploded into joy, and the men came up, and they were hugging me and kissing me, something that men generally didn't do back in Stangleville. In the middle of their meeting to figure out how to get rid of the Nazis, he appears seemingly out of thin air to tell them in their own language that the war was coming to an end. After six years of forced labor, executions, and knocks on the door in the middle of the night, he had arrived to tell them they were free. 